Hi friends, in this video, I'm just going to share some useful information. If you are using PHP console, whether it is a digital edition or descriptions, if you want to open internet browser, you can open it on PHP console. As of now, we do not have any options to navigate internet browser. Internet browser is there, but we couldn't open that. You can navigate any website in PHP console. There is a simple trick, just you need to follow. There is a two way you can open internet browser. So for that, right, uh, if you have some friend list, just open it. For example, I have friend list, going to profile. So under profile, right, I can see this friends options. If you do not have any friend list, right, just send a friend request to someone or create another PSN account, just add it as your friend. So here BK is my other friend. This one is I created personally and I have added it. So now I'm going to open this. Any friend list, any friends list you can open. So I'm going to tap it this VK. You can choose any friend's name here. So under your friend's profile, right? Just go to this chat. So send message. Tap the send message. So here, right? If you want to open any websites, you can click it here. For example, I just want to open google.com or uh, Gmail. I can do it. So enter your message. Here, right, I need to type www Google. So I'm going to send this message. Super cool. So once you sent it, right, www.google.com, go to that message by using this up arrow key. So now it is selected. I'm going to tap it now. Pressing X. Super cool, right? Internet browser is open. See this? Now I can navigate. If you attach the keyboard, right, you can navigate whatever you want. So here I'm going to type this uh, Disney or something. Search Disney. Cool. See, if you want to zoom it, you can zoom it by pressing R3 button. All the search results are displaying here now. See this? Super cool, right? You can navigate whatever you want. So now I'm going to close this by pressing circle button. And if you want to open another website like uh, your personal website. So for example, I have a website www. So message has been sent. Again, going to select that. See, automatically the website name is enabled here. So I'm going to open it on the browser. Wow, that's great. <laughs> Super cool. It's open. Even I can navigate my blog as well. So, okay, super cool. Now I'm going to show that opening Facebook R2. So I'm going to select that. Opening it. Now Facebook also is open and you can use your user ID and password to log in. Even you can create an account. You can choose forgotten password options. Now I'm going to show the Gmail, gmail.com. Simply I'm going to click this gmail.com R2. Going to select that. See, Gmail has been opened here. So you can use Gmail as well in PSP console. So now going back. So open Twitter. R2. Select it. So this is the way you can open any websites on your PSP console. So another way you can open it. So going back. Going back. So go to this settings. Under settings, right? go to user guide, health and safety. Even you can use Instagram as well. So go to user guide. And here you need to go to games, go to this game sections. Simply click on this about pre-orders. Here the options you can see PlayStation Store. But this is a little bit difficult. Use always friends send message options. So PlayStation Store has been open. Just scroll down all the way. So here you can see this option, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. Even you can open YouTube here. Tap on this YouTube. See, you can navigate here. 
So if you want to search and if you want to see any videos, music videos, you can do that. So two ways you can use internet browser on your PSP console. Easy method is just open friends list and just send message. Another way is we need to go to settings and we need to click on user guide and then PlayStation store. Then we can see the link YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, etc. That's it friends. I hope you will be liking this video. Definitely this video will be useful. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye.